Kensington Palace has been trying to stamp its authority after a series of leaks concerning Meghan Markle and Prince Harry, a royal expert has claimed. Kensington Palace has been trying to stamp some authority after leaks surrounding Meghan Markle and Prince Harry made their way into the press, according to royal expert Robert Jobson. Speaking on Sunrise, the royal expert claimed it was a mistake for Kensington Palace to get involved in the gender-fluid baby row. It came after reports Meghan and Prince Harry are planning to raise their baby gender fluid. Kensington Palace said reports the Duchess and Duke of Sussex will raise their child with a fluid approach are totally false. Mr. Jobson said, it does seem that story that was in People magazine, the American magazine that was sourced to five of her friends, the bottom line is, it was accurate. We then had a whole host of leaks coming out about the baby shower that was taking place in New York. It does seem there are clearly some people close to Meghan that are leaking stories and whether she is controlling it, we just don't know. He added, clearly, the palace themselves, these guys that are in the press office jobs want to stamp some authority. That is probably why they have got involved in this at the moment. To me, it is a bit of a mistake. If you start commenting on whether they are going to raise the baby gender fluid, the point is, are you going to comment on everything? It does seem a bit ludicrous to me. The row came after an article claimed Meghan told friends she and the Duke of Sussex planned to raise their child in a gender-neutral way. The source said, Meghan has been talking to some of her friends about the birth and how she and Harry plan to raise their baby. Her exact word was fluid. She said they plan to raise their child with a fluid approach to gender and they won't be imposing any stereotypes. The source was not clear on exactly what Meghan meant by gender fluid. Kensington Palace officials were forced to issue a statement on the claims. They said simply, this story is totally false. Meghan is expected to give birth to the couple's first child this spring.